legends. This update has been taken by storm. Get ready to dig into a set of events and new additions, plus the new campaign for the Russian light cruiser, Ochakov. Let's take a look. First and foremost, the new campaign is here. The Taken by Storm campaign features the Soviet light cruiser Ochakov, named after the smashing victory at the siege of Ochakov way back in the 18th century. This little ship comes packed with eight excellent six-inch guns and a diverse set of tools like long-range torpedoes, radar and sonar. The British heavy cruisers are leaving early access this update, meaning you can now progress all the way up to the Tier 7 Albemarle. This cruiser adds radar to the kit of the British heavy cruisers, giving them even more versatility in battle. Give them all a shot in the new update. Two of the legendary ships from New Year's are back, Conqueror and Gearing. This time they are here to stay, so get started on them in the Bureau. Gearing is the definitive American destroyer with a powerful mixed armament of dual-purpose guns and long-range torpedoes. While Conqueror is a monster of a battleship, armed with 12 419mm guns, capable of delivering absolutely devastating salvos. We're going to change things up for ranked battles this time around with two short weekend sprints. Although the losing team will still lose stars, every rank is irrevocable. Get ready to duke it out at Tier 4 from the 12th to the 15th and at Tier 5 from the 19th to the 22nd. Ranked battles are the best way to get steel badges, so be sure to compete and reach the top. We've got St. Patrick's Day over the horizon, but it's not just that. March 17th is also the launch day for HMS Belfast, so she will make a reappearance for the occasion. Be sure to get a hold of this famous British cruiser while you can, along with special St. Pat's bling, camos and more. The update brings a few changes to the Bismarck and Azuma to give them an extra edge in battle. Plus, there is a new American destroyer commander appearing, Albert Gleaves, whose skills will be useful in improving the torpedo capabilities of your destroyers. A couple of premium ships will appear during the update, the Italian light cruiser Duca d'Aosta and the pan-European destroyer that is equipped a radar consumable instead of a smoke generator, Orkin. Keep an eye on the event horizon. There may just be something on the way for April. Be sure and check the patch notes for more details on the events and changes and turn the tide.